Components are a core piece of status page. They help you show your customers and users which parts of your system are impacted by an incident. You can think of components as the individual pieces of your infrastructure or functioning pieces of your service or product. Creating components is easy, and you can add descriptions for each component so your users know exactly what you're reporting on. Here are a couple examples. Some of Dropbox's components include their website, desktop application, and mobile application. On Typeform status page, their components include forms, backend, notifications, and their website. They've also used a component group to organize several components that are related. So if we expand the developer platform component group, we'll see several components within it. This is a great way to organize similar components and keep your page easy to navigate. Components can be manually updated or automatically updated using an integration, using our API, or by configuring another tool like a monitoring system to send an email to a unique email address which we provide. Another way to automate components is by using our third-party components. Third-party components are services you already rely on, and their status is automatically updated on your page when that service reports an outage. But you can do more than just report downtime with components. With Uptime Showcase, you can display the historical uptime of your service and show the world all the times when things were functioning properly. You may have had a few blips here and there, but the majority of the time, your service is probably running smoothly. With Uptime Showcase, your status page can be used as a sales and marketing tool as well. To learn more about components, head over to help.statuspage.io.